And I think that's why I'm just surprised you don't have an SG in your collection. You have the Les Pauls, you have so many Strats, you have so many other guitars. I'm just a little surprised you've never had an SG. Yeah, you're right. I'm going to do something about it. I'll be right back. What? Oh, no. Don't be. Don't be. I'll be back. What? I'm back. <laughs> Oh my god. Can you guess what model this is? Is it an Epiphone? No. <laughs> no. no. I got one of those like that. But, yeah, yeah, yeah. Um, That's right, you do. You do have one of mine like this. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. But you have Ebony. You yeah, have I got Ebony. You got Ebony. Um, yeah. You think it's an Explorer? Uh, it's got kind of too small to be ex an Explorer. Flying V. Hold on. Could be a V. Hold on. Let me see. Oh, it's got some weight to it. I'm going to say another LP. Think uh, a Widowmaker Les Paul? Oh. Mm. <laughs> <laughs> wow. Well, let's open All this right. up. All right, let me see. I uh, I have a little razor here. That's okay. French. <laughs> That's French for cutting your thumb. That's French for cutting I'll your, right your thumb right open. Oh, man. I think it's got some sta Oh, it's got staples, too. Yeah. Er, murder. Oh, dude. Okay. Okay. A little plastique. Ooh, it's a leather. Ooh, a leather case. It oh. Looks like. And I think it's Corinthian leather. Oh, rich Corinthian leather. <laughs> oh my, er, my girl. Oh, by the way, you should say it's Bobby's here. Yeah, Bobby from the the Guitar Fret Zone. It's not Guitar Fret Zone. It's the Guitar Fret Zone. All right. Or, if Steve's been saying for the past couple of years, my buddy Bobby. My buddy Bobby. Finally came you should have just named your channel My Buddy Bobby. Ooh. It's uh You want to spin that around and face the other way? Yeah. And not drop it out of the case? And then lean it forward and uh, show people. Uh, okay. Uh, here's the money shot. Uh, a little timpani? Um, you ready? We're going to do... Oh, he's teasing it. It looks like it's black. Okay, here we go. One, mm. two, three. Mm. Whoa. It looks like an SG. Ebony. Damn, bro. It's all the paperwork. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. It's not too heavy. Some of them are lighter than others. Some I of them are light. I love your fretboard, though. I'd say it's less streaky than mine. Can we uh, put this up over here? Yeah, yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. See? See how mine's got more of the streaks? Yeah. Yours is way more consistent, and it's dark, which I like. Yeah, it's a bit darker, too. Oh, no, it's definitely darker. Boy, it looks and you great. haven't even oiled it yet. No, I haven't done anything. Yeah. Would you use mineral oil to get it dark in the rosewood? I would do mineral oil, yeah. Look at that, dude. And now you you said you bought this. I know that looked like a scratch, but it was yeah. Dust. I was a little worried there. <laughs> you, 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 yeah. You're like, what's that? I don't know you guys, <laughs> this, this was just us. I got a little worried <laughs> because I bought this through um, the Gibson uh, with Demo Shop, right? Demo Shop. Yeah. We don't say Mod Shop. That's another no, no, brand. No, no, the Demo Shop. <laughs> Out of the Demo Shop. Well, here. Yeah. Well, you gotta you gotta. Um, what are you giving me? Yeah. Uh, uh, Oh, here we go. Oh, yeah. Boy, this thing is, uh, oh, that must be inside the case. The, uh, oh, yeah, they might have uh, included that separately. Yeah. yeah, they usually do that. Yeah, it's probably in the bag. Boy, this thing is really light compared to yours. Yeah. Take a little hold first. Oh yeah, uh, you know you think that, but not not really. Oh, no, uh, okay. Yeah, but we'll check after. Yeah. Oh man. Played uh, 
uh, SGs that much before you. You want a strap or you go, you good? No, no, I'm good. You good? Okay. Yeah, let me just... Uh, I know, it's not the longest game. It's going to cross my legs like that. Yeah. You know, in the neck. I'm not really seeing any. I thought there was a little speck right there, but it was a piece of dust. Yeah. You know what it is? Is the and I, I find this on mine too. The inside of these cases are very furry. Yeah. And they, it's almost like that little bit of lint that sort of very comes off, and then you pull it out, and it the static makes it so dry out well, there. Well, probably not to mention in the factory, there's so much stuff floating around that's yeah. getting caught in there, and then being yeah. trapped in the case. Yeah. All those guys at the final line. You know. Um, it's a nice feeling neck. It's got oh, a little yeah. meat to it, but it's not uh, super thin. And I've never really played SGs. I mean, probably the first time I probably played an SG was Yaws, or maybe some of the other ones you had in the past. It but. looks killer, dude. Look at us. And and you know how we can tell them apart? I still have the sticker on mine. <laughs> yeah, mine doesn't have a sticker. Yeah. Yeah. You're making a good case for me to finally take my... Uh, my... Uh, Plastic. My plastic. Oh, off. yeah, you yeah. something pulled it off. Yeah, yeah. Yeah. Oh. Give it, the, give it the full look. Yeah, let's see here. It's probably in the case. Check it out. Boy, it really looks great on camera, huh? Doesn't it? Look at it down there. Yeah, this, 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 a money cam right there. Look at that thing. That looks nice. Damn. Well, it looks really, really nice. It doesn't it? <laughs> you know, I'm, I'm one of those, I don't know if, if you want to say I'm a, I'm a traditionalist, but I'm not really into, uh, you know, if you're getting an SG, I like the cherry, antique cherry, and I like... Yeah, uh, yeah, the, black, like the black or the antique cherry, but, or, and, and there's a brown. It's yeah. actually very classic as yeah. well. But that's your three classic colors. Yeah, I'm not into the crazy colors. Although I will say, once in a while, you see a white one come up, and... Uh, Sometimes, the well, the white with the look like a custom. It has the the, the binding. Yeah. The three pickups. Oh my Those god. Those look great. Those look amazing. As a matter of fact, I think I sent you a picture a couple of days ago. Was it a was it like almost like an emerald green SG? Did I send? Because I know a lot of times we'll send each other pictures. I, I thought it was that might have been, um, that might have been antique Pelham blue or faded Pelham blue. It, I it think was, it was, it was like it blue, was, but it's not crazy blue it's like it's a little bit <clears throat> lighter and not as much yeah. as in your face it's like a little bit you know so what do you think let me give it a quick comparison oh yeah just to see yeah, he, I'll, I'll put that right there you take that oh, you gotta, uh, i got it oh oh yeah Feels well, a yeah, yeah bit so so yeah so hold both of them in your hand at the same time Let's see what you think it, it, you I, see, it, you say it, but then once yeah. you hold it in your hand, you're like, oh, you know you what? Remember, I, think, I, I got yours on my right hand and left. Um, I think, it's ounces, if anything. You know what it is? Like, hold on, let me try it now with this side. You know what it could be? It just probably could be that I'm not used to holding an SG. Oh, That's an probably SG. what it really yeah. is. Because you were like, oh, it's light. And I'm like, uh, I don't know, bro. You know, I'm usually <laughs> playing either a Charvel or a Les Paul sometimes. And, uh, yeah, yeah. Listen, the Les Pauls have a little weight to them. Was this a little Christmas present to yourself? Yeah. Um, you okay. know, listen, I got, there was a great deal through, yeah. the, through the Gibson Dow Plus, you're shop. celebrating your new uh, things, position. Yeah, things happen well at work, and, you know. So. You're looking at the new assistant crew chief at the local Chick-fil-A, okay? The <laughs> assistant crew chief, let, okay? Let, uh, hold the applause, <laughs> hold the applause, you know. Um, yeah. No, but I've never really, you know, I... I think probably when you, when you got your SG, I was like, wow, the thing looks great. Because I never really yeah. paid... Uh, granted, you see Angus Young or Tony Iommi, and it's like, those look awesome. Yeah. But a lot of times, I just never really got one. Then you got yours, and, and you wouldn't tell me so long, you should get an SG. And, cause, and I played it, and I loved it. Yeah. And so then I was looking on the uh, Gibson demo shop, and uh, they had oh, this... Oh, they'll get you. Yeah. <laughs> and, and I started looking like, oh, my God, this, this is, this is like, pretty cheap. Oh, my God. It was a great yeah. deal, so I couldn't pass it up. Look at that puppy. Oh and, my and god. It, and it feels great. Gotta get 
those bends. You know what? This this uh, this guitar. Suffers from the same problem I had when I first got mine, and that is they really put the action low. And I know you love low action. You're probably in heaven with this guitar. Well, it actually felt pretty good. Yeah, yeah, I know. Yeah. See, you love it. I know you like. But for me, I and I went through this with this. I'm raising it up a hair. I'm lowering it a hair. Yeah. I think now it's too high. Now it's too low. And it took me a little bit. I have it exact. I have it yeah. exactly where I want and love it now. Mm -hmm. But it did take a little bit going yeah. back and forth. If this was my guitar, I would probably raise the action just a hair. It feels like a little too low to me, but it, here's the thing. I have just come to expect that because I like my action higher than most people. You know it. You pick yeah. up my guitar and you're always like, why is the action so high? And I'm like, because I like it that way. Even, and, uh, <laughs> I mean, so sometimes I say, is there something wrong with this? It, it seems off. <laughs> yeah. But actually lately I've, I've yeah. raised it a little, but I think the, the, the comfortability for me is that when I'm like at the 20th fret bending, yeah. where... If I feel that the string, I can get the string right in the middle of my finger. That's why I need it because my fingers are so thick. Yeah. If if the the action isn't high, the the next string next to it slips under. And and if, I if and I lose too, my bends. If it's too high, it'll go on top. If it's and too if high, it's too it goes low, on top. If it's too low, oh, and if it so, goes on top and gets under your nail, and then if you know, forget about realistically, it. Realistically, <laughs> if you look at our fingers, they're they're a bit different. So yeah, it's yeah. Comfortability oh, yeah. to it. No, no, no. I got I get big ham hocks. But here. for me, if I can get it right in the middle when I'm bending and. It feels comfortable. Yeah. I mean, it's not going to slip off. Like that's perfect. So, yeah, yeah. But this yeah. is all pretty good so but far. But it, it's the same um, situation for me with every manufacturer because no manufacturer sends out a guitar with high action yeah. because they get complaints. People come back, oh, the action was really high and it wasn't set up and all this yeah. stuff like that. And so I just realized that it's me, not them. Yeah. But if this was my guitar, I'd probably crank that bridge just up a just a hair. Yeah. <laughs> Pretty damn good. Okay. Wicked crisp. I can just see over here that the, the fretboard, I'm looking at Jaws on the desk. And I can see that the, the fretboard's just a little bit darker, which oh, I know. Oh, no, it's It's absolutely dark. <laughs> What is good to pretend on them? Yeah, I think what it is is um I think, and this is just my personal opinion, I think darker rosewood has a better resale value, better resale proposition to it. That's why so many people like to take light rosewood and try and make it darker. Mm -hmm. And it's just become because the subs when rosewood got on the sites list, mm -hmm. all the substitutes were lighter. Yeah. Right? And so, like, is it Pau Ferro? Is it that Lingdom Vitae or whatever the hell? Or you can bake people using baked maple. And they all look a little bit lighter. And the whole yeah. thing about the rosewood is that it was so dark, you know, and I'm saying in certain yeah. ones, you know, it was, it was consistently dark, brown dark, but, you know, not the black dark that yeah. ebony is, but it was still a chocolate Darker. brown, yeah. you know, uh, you know, a coffee brown, you know, really good, consistent. And I think with the, with now that... It's, you know, been substituted so many times, people just look for the dark rosewood as sort of the seal of approval that this is rosewood. And ebony is a lot more, putting ebony is a lot more expensive than rosewood at this point, right? I think so, yeah. And yeah. you're not going to find it on any of their so-called, like, classic custom, Only cus custom jobs. No, right? oh, no, you could, no, you, you get it on the custom, oh, absolutely. Okay. Yeah. But the other one that they're doing it on now is the modern. So if you don't want to spend custom shop money, oh, okay. if you just want, like, this guitar... Uh, with an ebony fretboard and maybe it's a little bit of hotter pickups and a big yeah. scoop on the back, right? It's, it's, like, it's the modern. The, you, you get the modern. And the modern has um, uh, modern electronics, yeah. you know, Push and pull, ebony fretboards. Like exactly. Yeah. And like, um, you know, all kinds of just like what, what they would consider like a hot rod, like yeah. a modern, like hot rod version. Yeah. And uh, 
So you don't have to break the bank. You don't have to get a, a custom, which is yeah. out of the, only out of the custom shop now, right? I mean, you're looking at probably. Oh, I see some of the prices. More than like yeah, like fifty percent to maybe even a hundred percent. I think the one of the I was looking through one of them. Um, it was the musician's friend or one of those things that come in the mail, and I think one of the. You know, customs, the lowest one was, I think, around 3500 3400 They had a Kirk Douglas. Have you seen that one? No. So it's the SG Custom, but it's got, like, three pickups, and they might be the Firebird pickups or something like okay. that. And it's this killer, like, green, like this amazing green oh, really? color. Like, oh, my God, it's a... It's a, Did it have it's binding a and stuff too? And oh, it's binding. Oh, binding. It's, oh dude, it's okay. a, it's a, no, it's and a the diamond, at the, diamond, the diamond at the top. Diamond at the top and yeah. the block and lace. Oh, it, it's custom. It's, it, yeah. you know, it's great. 2800 bucks on Guitar Center used. It, dude, it sold in like a nanosecond. Yeah. <laughs> like, that's a... Well, that's the thing on there, too. That's if, a good if, price if, for if, that guitar. You know, for anybody who's <laughs> listening, if you ever sometimes see a guitar like used at a great price, it's one of those, get on the phone and call them right now and put it on hold because it can go... By the time you're putting... Seconds. It, it can go so fast. Seconds. And the prices there are pretty decent sometimes on used, too. So. Oh, my God, yeah. Oh, my God. But you got this... Well, let's call it new... Yeah. Even though it's demo. It's a twenty twenty one. It's a twenty twenty one, yeah. So let's look let's look at it. It is Oh, dude, this is recent. Uh so let's just uh, let's just look this up. Um uh, number Calendar 2021. There we go. So you are. Uh, it's two two thirty nine. Remember two thirty nine. Two thirty nine. Oh come on! We don't have a day. You don't have a number calendar with a day. Oh, come on. Where are you? To be made around June sometime then? Yeah, so what? No, no, later, I think. 365 days. You were at 239? Oh, okay. I'm sorry. I wasn't thinking. Yeah. Also oh, around August. Yeah, 239th day of 2021 is Friday, August 27th. Okay. Yeah. That's when this guitar was made. So yours is, this is much younger than mine. Mine was made April tenth, I think. You got it around April or March. Or yeah, something. yeah. I think it was. I think they made it. I think it was finalized April tenth. I, I, no, no, no. I bought it April tenth. It was finalized on April eleventh. Okay. And, and then, they didn't and then ship when did you it. Get it? They, they didn't ship it till the twenty first because then it goes in the queue for shipping. Oh, okay. Right. And so it's like it just took over because they were backed up on the ship. Because I thought you had got it before the summer started. Because I remember coming over here. That oh, day. dude. Yeah. No. Yeah. yeah I, I could not believe they shipped it so fast. You got this really fast. Yeah. Because you were calling me the other night going like, you, you know, what, what should I do? And I'm it going, was, buy it. It was Buy a, it, bro. Almost a day and a half. Buy it, bro. Day and a half shipping. <laughs> yeah. Which was pretty good. Yeah. Wow. That you is know. incredible. And uh, I've never had an SG before. And, you know, you know, a lot of times um, we'll be texting each other late night on different guitars and hot prices. Yeah. And I was kind of seeing this. And then I sent it over to Steve. And I'm like... I feel like I got to get it. It looks great. It was a great price. Um, supposedly something. When I was reading the description, it wasn't something wasn't buffed in the inner horn or something like that. Yeah, I was looking for that. Quite frankly, and I was kind of looking around for a dent or a scratch. I mean, they haven't gone through it thoroughly, but I was looking. Yeah, for something. you know what? Um, I, I I find a lot of these so-called dent and scratch. There really isn't any dents or scratch. You know, I mean, they they, they if you look at the photos, they'll do a close up. Yeah. And you'll see, like, the tiniest little thing. But, you know, they're going after the spec queens, you know, the dudes who get a guitar, you know, and they're yeah. like Inspector Gadget. They go over the whole thing with a magnifying glass. I mean, the only thing I really see is, is just dust from the case. That's, that's, a, that's all I'm seeing is just dust. And, um, and don't forget, there's an incredible amount of dust down here, Oh, too. of course. Well, yeah. for use this basement. Little, Look at that. You got to back, back it up. You got to back it up. Yeah, there, there you go. go. There you go, kid. <laughs> see the next. Look at that thing. That is nice. It does look good. All right, dudes. Well, there you have it. The SG. The surprise SG. Not really, but 
Surprise guest. Surprise guest. Uh, right before Christmas, you know. And, uh, listen, I guess my message is this. Treat yourself to a guitar this Christmas, okay? What are you doing? Come on. FOMO, bro. YOLO. YOLO. I couldn't wait for Santa. <laughs> you know, you got the FOMO, you got a YOLO. All right, there you go. There you have it. As always, no, you rock. As always. Wait, let's get them both side by side. I'm I, going to do the double. Doubleman twins? Yeah. <laughs> there you go. All right, put your, head, put your neck a little higher. But no, no, no. More like, yeah, like that. Okay. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Going like that, yeah. You got to tilt back. You got to tilt yours back a little bit. There we go. How's that? There you go. Nice. And then you tilt it forward just a hair. Uh, there we go. Uh, All right. Oh, Don't oh. look at the screen. Look at the camera lens. Say cheese. Give it a little smile. There's our thumbnail. All right. <laughs> there we go. There you go. All right, dudes, as always. The guitar fret zone. The guitar, the guitar fret zone. Forget that guy with guitar fret zone. That guy's an, an idiot. Yeah. You want the guitar fret zone. He's getting charges pressed on him. Exactly. <laughs> Never forget that. All right, dudes, as always. Thanks, thanks so much for Happy holidays. Out. Rock on.